Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of The Search for Snacks and I was in I believe this was either the 99 cent store or grocery outlet one of the two I think it was a grocery outlet and you know I was going around there and I found a whole bunch of cool stuff that I wanted to try and this is the first one and like I said I think it was only a dollar for this I don't remember exactly because everything was like a blur. <laughs> I got two big bags full of stuff. So, tried this one. This is Bugles, and I haven't tried this flavor. This is bold barbecue flavor. And you know, it says here, America's number one finger hat. And you put the Bugles on your finger and you try them. 150 calories per one and one third cups. Oh, I thought it said one and one third chips. <laughs> it's like, how do I measure a third of a chip? Six percent, six grams saturated fat, 240 sodium, and three total sugars. So, and yeah, for 150 calories for one and third cups and 410 for the whole bag and the sodium on the whole bag is 680 eh, not too bad on the back here it says who should eat bugles anyone jockey moms and hockey dads <laughs> aunt and uncle croquet teams cookie clubbers race car drivers scuba divers that dive in rivers train yakkers yak trainers Game board ex rule explainers, window washers, runners, walkers, four out of five doctors, and everyone. Who the heck wrote this lame? <laughs> I don't know. And anywhere he's on the here on the back, it, it has uh, other flavors of nacho cheese, caramel, and uh, ranch. And it says ta da da. And. This one, I guess it could be, I, I'm gonna have to put this hashtag on here. And Mickey's always talking Butterfingers, but this one is Bugle Fingers. <laughs> hashtag Bugle Fingers. And, and there we go. So now that I've got all that out of the way, I'm going to go ahead and open this and give it a try. I can smell that uh, barbecue, okay. Not too terrible, a little more than half. Kind of settled. Some of these ones lately, they give you like mostly air. You're paying for air. Okay, here's the bugles. You know that. I don't think my fingers are gonna fit in there, but I'll go ahead and give one a try, maybe a couple more. Hmm, ooh. Barbecue, I can taste that right off the bat. Mm. Yeah, a real kind of spicy, a bold spicy barbecue. It's if you put you know, barbecue sauce on these, kind of a little bit of smoky flavor. Mm. Not bad. Hmm. Kind of like that. Hmm. Yeah, it's almost got like a peppery flavor to that with that smoky barbecue. A little bit of pepper to it. I like the crunch of these. Um, oh yeah, paprika, spices, mustard seed, vinegar, salt, smoke flavor. Yes, that's what I'm tasting. Salt, spices. 
brown sugar, paprika, tomato powder, onion powder. Yeah, I'm tasting that little kind of, just, it's actually a little bit uh, spicy. I think that's that pepper or paprika that's in there that's making a little bit, just a little bit of spicy, a little bit of, I wake up, I can taste that flavor. Not a bad flavor. Bold barbecue, definitely is bold. So for that one, Bugles Bold Barbecue. Hmm. I give that one. Hmm. That's not too bad. I'll give that one a seven. Seven out of eleven. I mean, it's just Bugles. The spice isn't anything spectacular. Got a little bit of spice, a little bit of pepper. A little bit of smoke. I'm sure you've tried Bugles before. You've seen these. Got them a whole bunch of different flavors. Um, it's always good to try one. Like I said, I was in there and I hadn't tried them before, so I thought I'd give them a shot. Um, they are pretty good. So if you like the video, give it a good thumbs up. And don't forget to hit your subscribe and the notification bell over there. That way you won't miss any future content or if I go live. So until next time, on Drew's Food Reviews, where I'll be trying something new for you. I'm going to go ahead and try to cook a few more of these. I'm probably going to have to get some drink because it is a little bit... I'm getting a little bit of spice on it, but not a lot. Mm -hmm. So until next time, on Drew's Food Reviews. Talk to you later.